We conducted an experiment using the Pokemon simulator Pokemon Showdown. We wanted to test how well a player's ELO ranking would predict their win rate. ELO is a ranking system created by Arpod ELO for use in rating chess players, but many online and real life games have adopted the system as well, including Pokemon Showdown. Under the ELO systems, players gain less points from beating a player with a lower ELO and lose less points from losing to a player with higher ELO. In our study, Jan represented a player with high ELO, while Ben represented a player with low ELO. Our null hypothesis was that there would be no difference in the proportion of games we each win. Our alternative was that there would be a difference. Note that these rankings are from our main accounts, as we made new accounts to carry out the experiment. To ensure random assignment in our experiment, we chose pairs of players with a random number generator from the player list and flipped a coin to decide which player Ben and Yon would challenge to a battle. Some players had refused their challenges, which explains the slight difference in the size of Ben's and Yon's samples. The data we obtained yielded a p-value of 0.923 for a two-tailed, two-proportion z-test. We checked that all conditions were met. Because our p-value was higher than any reasonable significance level, we failed to reject the null hypothesis. We conclude that for Pokemon players, ELO does not necessarily predict skill. So if ELO doesn't predict skill, what sort of rating does? The Glico rating system, invented by Mark Glickman for chess, is one of the best ratings for this purpose. Rather than boil your rating down to a single number, Glickle gives a 95% confidence interval for your true rating. And since Ben and Jan actually have similar Glickle ratings, it is not very surprising that we fail to reject our null hypothesis. Unfortunately, Glickle is rather cumbersome to use for matchmaking and tournament qualifications, since two Glickles are not easily comparable. Thus, Smogun, the online community which owns and operates Pokemon Showdown, has created many of their own ratings for these purposes. ACRE is the 8th percentile of a player's rating distribution based on their Glico rating, so we are 92% confident that any random player is better than their ACRE. It was scrapped because players can get ACRE rating after losing a battle. GXZ gives the probability that a, prob that a player would defeat any other randomly selected player, and COIL, which is used for tournament qualification, is a function of GXZ and games played. Notice that our GXZs predicted that we would win a higher proportion of games than we actually did. This is likely because the team we used was not very good, causing us to lose games we would have known normally.